We've added the nuclear silo to Balloons Tower Defense 6, a mortar monkey paragon that gets its paragon degrees in a really unique fashion. Instead of getting its power from other mortar monkeys, it actually requires sacrifices from other explosive towers. This tower is so powerful that it doesn't shoot normally. You have to use the ability to launch a nuclear missile that destroys everything on the screen. Unfortunately, meddling with such a power comes at a cost though. At round 100 140, the police BAD is going to come away to take me to jail for messing with nuclear components in my secret lab. The police BAD has millions of HP and will put all my monkeys in jail if it gets close to them, imprisoning them forever. <gasps> if you enjoy these custom modded videos, please hit that like button, subscribe, and turn on notifications. All right, we're playing. Obviously, we're in our secret laboratory, okay? Bigger blast, balloon buster. Let's roll, all right? Let's do this. Oh, the, the problem with this mortar monkey is he's not really hitting it like in the middle i think i need to like have it over on the edge just a little bit we're still kind of having a little bit of problems though i guess i can just put down my free dart monkey what do you mean my free dart monkey won't put down rare okay let's get long range and enhanced eyesight allows him to pop some balloons here so we need to get the mortar paragon up and running okay but that's gonna be really expensive do we see it look the nuclear silo <laughs> look at the look at the upgrade this description was destroyed in the testing process. Oh my gosh. And this is this mod's made by Dat Jane Doe. And you always know that when Dat Jane Doe makes a mod, it's gonna be absolutely like like crazy. I, if you any of our modders ever makes any mods, it's always gonna be like super duper crazy, amazing awesomeness. So well, let's go ahead. We're gonna need some money, okay? This actually stuns balloons, so that might be a, a better thing to get. And then get faster reload and rapid reload. And that'll be really nice. I want, because I just want a bigger explosion for this bet. Oh my gosh, I wasn't picking up any of my bananas. I guess we do have banana salvage on, but still, that's like a decrease in bananas. Like, you're getting nasty old bananas. We already got one mortar monkey. We are going to need three mortar monkeys. I say we put them all, like, right here. So, I'm going to put, I'm going to put a village right, right here. Let's see, like that, and I can get bigger radius. And then that guy is going to be able to do that. And we're going to need all three mortar monkeys anyways, just because we need them for the paragon. So we can just put them down right here. So we got these bad boys. And we're going to have this dart monkey be able to pop some, some pesky old b b flabbergasted and balloons. All right. So let's go ahead. So this guy's going to be top path. This guy, I guess, could be middle path. But I guess I really do want to focus on getting that banana plantation and getting that money up and running because, I mean, the nuclear silo is $648,000. That is really expensive. Okay, that costs us a lot of money. I need to focus on my financial security here, okay? All right, I'm going to go ahead and get the biggest, the, the big one upgrade because that's going to be really, really nice. I'm going to go ahead and get heavy shells because heavy... Oh, wait, no, 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 no. I want, I need, I need, I need, I need middle path. That's what I need. I want to sell this guy as quickly as possible. I want this dart. I want it to only use mortar monkeys on this map. It kind of works out. Like, I wanted to do this map anyways because it's like a nuclear, like, uh-oh, uh-oh. Are we okay? Yeah, we're fine. We're fine. All right, let's get jungle drums and then radar scanner. And then I need, I need MIB. No, I need a banana research facility. What am I doing, Ryan? Now we're starting to make some big money, which is really nice. So I want to get my MIB because MIB just makes me very happy. And let's go, all right, heavy shells, artillery battery, and obviously a bigger blast, bloom, bloom buster. They have so many tongue twisters in this game. Blue balloons, bloom buster, artillery batter. Okay, that's not even that one, but you, you, you're picking up what I'm picking, picking down. Shattering shells, balloon incineration, balloon incineration. That's one thing that I'm actually really grateful for, for being a YouTuber. Something that has helped me out is, I'm gonna sell this guy, is it's helped me with my public speaking. It's helped me with, like, enunciations and stuff. As a kid, I could not pronounce my SHs. I had, I wouldn't say, like, it was a speech impediment, but, like, I could, I like, I like, sh Shally Shells, I, literally, as a kid, I, like, Sally Shells, She Shells by the She Short, like, She, She, I was, like, I just couldn't do it. And, I mean, I still kind of struggle with it, but being able to be, like, every day enunciation and talking and practicing that has helped me a lot, and it's something I'm very grateful for. Uh-oh. All right, phew, that was spooky. <laughs> and we are gonna wanna make sure that we have every single uh, explosive tower as well for the Paragon because it gives it more upgrades as we go along. I mean, obviously we are gonna wanna get a couple more banana research facilities. All right, so we can get pop and awe and now we can go ahead and get balloon incineration. There we go. And there it is, nuclear silo. 
this description was destroyed in the testing process. So we need $648,000. That is a lot of money. That is a lot. I mean, what we can do is like, we can start skipping some rounds because when we start skip, like look at how much money we make by skipping rounds. So that's going to be more than fine. So we can start skipping rounds because we, I kind of want to just make the money so we can get that nuclear silo. Oh my goodness. All right, we're at 200,000. Uh, let's see, that only has a thousand pops. Oh my gosh, because it's it, it's too like pinpoint. There we go. All right, what's this, does this guy have pops? How's this guy doing? They're too accurate. I, I put them like right in the middle and they actually just can't reach anything. That's a little bit awkward. This one, the uh, blue incineration is really not that good for this particular map. All right, we're getting really close. Oh, round 76, round 76 didn't even stand a chance. We did $648,000, that's a lot of money. Do I want to get bananas? It's, it's been too, it's, we're too, it's too late. Too late for, what the heck? That thing just annihilated it. All right, there we go, round 79. All right, we are so close to getting the nuclear silo. I'm really excited for getting the nuclear silo. And, all right, we can get the nuclear silo. I'm gonna turn off auto start and then we can get the nuclear silo and then we can go up against round 80 and see what the nuclear silo does against round 80. I hope it does really well because considering we have to deal with the police bad that shows up around 140, we're gonna need some, uh, we're gonna need a little bit more luck with that. Look, at that's actually so crazy strong. That stuns it for a really long time. Alrighty, and bada bing bada boom. All right, nuclear silo. This action will create a Paragon Mortar Monkey. All other Mortar Monkeys will be destroyed. So here we go. And oh boy. Oh my gosh, that looks so cool. The Mortar Monkey is only Paragon degree level one. So basically is we have this ability now. And this is ability that when we use it, it actually absorbs all explosive towers. So uh, we want to get like bomb towers. I think it's only T5 bomb shooters. I could be wrong about that. So right. So it's not shooting right now. So it doesn't shoot until we use this button. So if you've enjoyed up until now, please hit that like button, subscribe, turn on notifications. Let's see what the power of this guy is, is gonna be. Ready? Three, two, one. <laughs> that guy just got messed up. Holy cow. What is this? What is the map? The entire map just turned into nuclear radiation. Oh my gosh, it's a war zone. Oh my gosh, that was just absolutely devastating. Where is it? There it is. I can't even see what's going on anymore. So that bomb shooter didn't get, holy cow, that was absolutely bonkers. All right, let's get more. So every one of these actually upgrades it. So like, boom, so it sacrificed it and now it's at Paragon degree level 19. So what, I, oh my gosh, this is devastating. I can't even see the map anymore. It's just fire. It's just nuclear radiation. No wonder the police are gonna be coming after me. Look, I'm just like skipping rounds and it just doesn't even care. Uh oh, boom. That's so satisfying. Okay, so let's put down all the T5s because every single one that, every T5 bomb shooter that we put down, every time we use that ability, it actually sacrifices again for a higher tier. Let's also put down a submarine. We wanna make sure that we have a preemptive strike and we also wanna get Sar Bomba. Here, we can use that ability again. Oh, let's see. Oh, it's already up to degree level 38. That's so nice. Uh, yeah, we just keep putting these more of these down because it absorbs them. So we can put that down and every T5 bomb shooter is gonna be like so powerful. All right, ready and... Oh, here, let's get the middle path and... Oh, we can also go ahead and get the bottom path too. And then do it again, bobbing, boom. Look at that, we're at Paragon degree level 53. So we're actually just going up in Paragon degrees. Wait, we're on round 99. I'm so excited to see what round 100 is gonna look like. Do you think, what's round 100? All right, so it just wore off. All right, round 100 versus the BAD. Three, two, one. Let's see how quickly it destroys it. <laughs> That's nutty. Yeah, I keep, uh-oh, 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 no, 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 I lost. I lost because I didn't hit the button fast enough. Wait, I'm on round 212. I skipped the round on accident. I accidentally skipped. We're not going up against the police. Okay, we're on round 212. Let's just see what happens on like round 212. <clears throat> okay, let me try that again. Let me see. 
Wait, what? Oh my gosh, I'm up to round 300 because of the raise button. <laughs> okay, let's, all right. Let me get back to round 140 and let's do this. All right, so I kind of messed that up. My, that was a, that's a little bit of a whoopsies, but that's fine. Let's put all of the things down so we can sacrifice it to get a higher Paragon degree. Because it was at like a 50, level 50 Paragon degree, but that's fine. Like, oh, there it is. Here it comes. So there's the police BAD. If we put it down, does he like jail my guys? <laughs> let's see. Oh my gosh, he looks so evil. Maybe they don't do enough damage. He's not worried. He's not worried about these guys. They're too weak. Oh my wait, I need to oh my gosh, let's do this. Oh my gosh. Holy cow, this thing is terrifying to look at. What de paragon degree level is it? Oh my gosh, it's already at two million pops. Two million pops already. That is bonkers. Uh-oh. I might have I might have taken a little bit. Oh no, I might have not I might have not popped it soon enough. I might have not been ready for it. Okay, we just gotta keep upgrading it. Keep upgrading it. We gotta use these abilities as much as we can because it all it increases the damage. Oh we're popping it! We're popping it. Okay. We just gotta keep putting down balloon crush and other like bomb towers. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Level it up. It's so slow. Okay, use it again. Alright, I don't know what paragon degree level we're at right now. I don't even see the tower anymore. I don't even know what's going on. All right, just keep putting things down. Wait, where'd it go? Wait, well, I have a bomb tower over here too? What the heck? What are you doing here, friend? All right, there we go. All right, where... Wait, where is this thing? It's at Paragon degree level 61. It has 12 million pops already. 12 million pops. That is a strong Paragon tower. And it's just doing damage to, like, one guy. I would love to see... I guess we can't do it in creative mode. Oh, because it's a paragon. You're not allowed to use paragons in creative. I'd love to go into sandbox mode and see what would it like what would happen there. Let's see. Yeah, it's at 67 degree paragon. All right, let's just keep using the explosion. 17. Oh my gosh, 17 million pops. Keep using the explosions. Is, are we gonna get past 20 million pops and destroy this thing? How much HP does this BAD have? The police BAD does not mess around. All right, these guys are coming to mess my day up. All right, get them out of here. I'm a criminal now. I'm a war criminal. I've created a nuclear. These police, they ain't gonna stop me. <laughs> I, you know what? I just thought about it, and I guess I'm the bad guy in this situation. I'm literally dealing with nuclear, and I'm fighting the police. That's probably not a good idea, but that's fine. We're playing with monkeys right now. Uh, if I had to give you, um, you know, th I don't think I have to say this, but I'll, I'll say it anyways. Don't become a, a war criminal and use nuclear weapons. Uh, just saying. That's like, that's normally considered a big no-no. So I wouldn't do that if I were you. So, because that's, yeah, that's not, oh, there we go. Let's go. That's what I'm talking about. Oh my gosh. It just froze the whole screen. 33 million pops. That's a lot of pops, everybody. That's a ton of pops. Thanks for much for watching. I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, hit that like button, subscribe, turn on notifications, and uh, I hope you have a great day, my friend.